Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Please give this video a thumbs up to help the channel grow. Click the bell icon at the top of the page to get notified when I post a new video. Universal Channeling Channeling the Conscious Universe for the New World Consciousness Blossom Goodchild, Channeling the Federation of Light, March 2, 2024 Blossom Goodchild Here we are again, then. Hello. This question was asked to be asked and I thought it may be a refreshing change. I don't know if you will answer it all, or just in general. Since the light affects all aspects of the whole, how will these phases, and finally, the event itself, affect our personal lives? For example, how will our love relationships and friendships change? How will our desires and drives change? What will our work, or career look like? How will our thoughts, behaviors, ideas, mindsets and attitudes toward the world change? How will our families and relatives, and our relationships with them, change, and so on, and so forth? In other words, how will these things change us, and our everyday lives, as opposed to things of a more global scope? Federation of Light. Welcome Blossom. Welcome to each one. It is indeed something we would like to talk about with you as it involves your future selves. Of course, an individual is an individual, and therefore, one's changes will depend on how that individual chooses to conduct one's life, no matter what is taking place upon your planet. That will never change. The phases, of which there are five, will take you on journeys as yet unknown. And within the period of the time these take, many aspects of self will morph into a higher grade of self. Eventually, there are to be truths revealed that will disturb the psyche of each one. Much confusion on many levels will incur as one tries to decipher all that is presented. There will still be those, even though evidence is presented, that will refuse to believe, that which is before their very eyes. Blossom good child. Will they think, whatever it is, is CGI, AI etc.? Federation of Light. For a short while. Yet, when it is evident that there is no such trickery taking place, there shall be a process of processing all that needs to be processed. That which is to come is indeed, life-changing. Values will change. Points of opinion will change. For quite a while, many shall sit in a nummified status, not knowing what to think, believe, or, where to turn. Yet, no, dearest souls. There is nothing to fear. This is a process which has to occur in order for your world to move forward. So, as with everything. In time. Your time. All that has radically shocked and rocked your entire planet, will begin to settle. Because. The good news is. Once the bad news has been processed. And one recognizes that all such atrocities and lies are no longer able to rule your lives. It is then that great changes will take place within the self. The good news is. When phase two arrives. Which it will shortly. Blossom good child. Whoa. Steady Neddy. Using the term shortly could get one excited. I wanted to sneakily not write that word, yet, it is not for me to remove, just because I don't like it. Federation of Light. When it arrives, one can choose to look upon it as a huge step in the right direction, even though everything one is seeing, hearing, and experiencing is appearing as the opposite. Yet, we trust many of you know better than to fall for the narrative, as to the while things are happening. Behind the scenes, preparation has been taking place on an unimaginable scale. So that when the lid blows off, the divine plan will be one of reassurance. Blossom good child. That's good to know, for it feels like many would not be able to cope with what is to be told, and we don't really know who exactly is going to be doing the telling. So, you are saying that alongside of the truth being revealed, there will also be revelations as to how the world carries on from there? Federation of Light. This is correct. Obviously, it cannot be plain sailing. No one, on, or off planet, knows how the reactions of each individual will present, and therefore, one cannot gauge the energies that will be in uproar and how this may affect the whole, regarding moving forward. Hindrances are to be taken into account. The course of action will be conducted one step at a time, even though it is known where the plan is leading. To try and keep on course with the question. It is for you to know that the changes in self are to be wondrous. Should one choose to follow the path that is being offered, due to what has been uncovered, there will be many that remain stuck in the shock of it all, for much longer than others. However, again we reiterate that there is no need to fear anything. And to always remember, no matter what, the light has won. So, 
moving through the different phases will be a time when one moves through the different phases of self, also. For, each phase is a continuum from the previous one, and how one flows with the changes as each phase arrives, will, of course, determine each individual outcome. Blossom good child. So, from what you are saying, it doesn't seem likely that we can simply laugh our way through all that is to come. I get the impression that we all shall be very much affected by all that is to be revealed. You have even said that it is beyond our imagination. So, I take that to mean it is so much bigger than we think it is to be? Federation of Light. This is so blossom. Yet, it does not mean laughter cannot be heard. Throughout all that is to take place, you know that once dealt with, once one has come through it, that which lies waiting for you, was worth every moment of everything one has experienced to get there. Blossom good child. Which is where? Back to the question. How will relationships, jobs, well, in a nutshell, life be so different once it's all over? Does phase 5 mean we have reached the new way of life? Or, after phase 5? Federation of light. After. For there are no phases to be carried out from then on. The plan will have completed its mission. And there will simply be a new way of living. In a way that life upon your beautiful planet was designed to be lived. Blossom good child. We are nearly at the point of answering the question. It's making me laugh. So, what is this new way of living to be like for the individual? Federation of Light. Joy. 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 Imagine old programs lifted. Imagine yourself living in your truth without the bombardment of interferences to mind, body, and soul. Blossom good child. It's difficult to imagine. That's why this, so far unanswered question, is being asked. Federation of Light. We too, are having fun with you Blossom. Everything within you will have changed. It is difficult to put into words. Your knowing of truth will have brought you to a place within self, that is so much more of who you are. You desire to know of day-to-day -day runnings of work, of relationships, of everything that is to be in your life? Know how you feel on a really good day in these times. Then multiply that feeling many, many, times. This is the place your soul will have vibrationally risen to. Because of all that you have endured to get yourself and your planet to that higher vibrational position. It will be a pleasure to wake up each day and be. A pleasure to live in harmony with one another and all life. A pleasure to know love as love is. Blossom good child. Can I pick you up on that? To know love as, love is? Federation of light. By this, we mean that in your present. There is so much that has pulled down the vibration of love light on your planet. Yes, love is love is love. Yet, on many different levels of itself, and due to the darkness dominating for so, so long, the highest vibrational level of love in this now, that feeling of really feeling at one's best, is of a level that feels good to you, feels wonderful. Yet, it is as if it has had a cap on it, unable to rise higher. Yet, now, as you are well aware, because the darkness has been defeated, the level of love energy is able to enter into your planet at a higher frequency which many of you are already feeling. As more and more higher vibrational energy enters in, you have the freedom to rise up to meet it. It is of a higher energy long forgotten on your planet. In slash a slash of itself, its vibration will continue to lift in frequency. In slash a slash of itself, it carries within it a higher vibration of love itself, which has not been experienced on such a high level for eons of time. Imagine that. Blossom good child. Yep. I love it when I feel really good. So, to enjoy that feeling magnified a thousandfold is not only going to blow my blouse up. It will probably blow it off. Imagine that. Federation of light. We are aware we have not answered the question in great detail. We cannot. For you, each one, are the conductors of your own lives and how you choose to live them. Whether that be of the now, or of the future. When love in its purest highest form becomes all that you are, there are no descriptional words to convey that feeling. Yet, we can say, that what is to come, after the fall, is the reason you came here to see it through, into a new brighter world, where you know yourselves to be love, and in love with all living things. Glorious days await you. Remember that, throughout all that is to come. Remember, love conquers all. Blossom good child. Well. Although this chat has sort of mixed messages, I do feel you have done very well in preparing us for what we must face. Yet, in the knowing, 
that we shall all live happily ever after. Onwards. Ever onwards troops. Many, many, thanks. In gratitude. In loving service. I am. Website, blossomgoodchild.com